a new friend. Hey, can you throw me the ball? Sure, here you are. You're new, aren't you? Yes, I am. Where are you from? I'm from China. What's your name? Wang Ho. How do you say hello in Chinese? Ni hao. Ni hao. Hey, this is cool. I can speak Chinese. Are the children playing in the park? Yes, they are. Is Wang Ho from India? No, he isn't. He's from China. How does Wang Ho say hello in Chinese? Ni Hao. Looking for Ricky. Oh, I'm lost. Where's Ricky? Excuse me, please. I'm looking for Ricky. What's he like? He isn't tall. He's short. He hasn't got dark hair. He's got blonde hair. He's got a small nose and a small mouth. Rocky, are you looking for me? I'm here. Look. Is Ricky in the street? No, he isn't. Is Rocky looking for Ricky? Yes, he is. What's Ricky like? Ricky has got blonde hair, a small nose, and a small mouth. On the farm. Here's the farm. It's big. There are lots of animals here. Look at the horses. They are nice and big. There's a cow and a cute little calf. Look, he's drinking milk. I like milk. But I don't like cows. Help! How many animals are there on the farm? There are lots of animals. What's the little calf doing? He's drinking milk. Does Rocky like cows? No, he doesn't. The Prince and the Pauper. I'm bored.
I haven't got any friends. Oh, the prince! What a lucky boy! Hey, you! Come here! What's your name? Tom Canty, sir. Wow! You're just like me. Dark hair, green eyes. Give me your clothes and take mine. And take this ring, too. Later. You! Get out! No! No! I'm... Help me, please! I'm the prince! Poor boy. You're mad. I'm not the prince. Poor prince. He's mad. Now here, beg for money. No! Stop! You can't do that. Thank you. I am the prince, and you are now a duke. Let's go to the palace. Tom! Tom, look at me! Oh, sir, I'm so glad. Here is your crown, sir, and your ring. Take them back, please. Has the prince got any friends? No, he hasn't. What are the prince and Tom like? They have got dark hair and green eyes. Does Tom want to be a prince? No, he doesn't. Birthday surprise. What are you doing, Rocky? I'm making a cake for Ricky. It's his birthday today. What have you got there? I've got some eggs, some sugar, some chocolate. Have you got any butter? Butter? No. I haven't got any butter. Well, making cakes is easy. Later, at the party... I'm sorry, Ricky. Making cakes isn't easy. It's difficult. What's Rocky doing? He's making a cake for Ricky. Is there any butter? No, there isn't. How old is Ricky? He's nine. Ricky's weak. On Mondays, I play football. On Tuesdays, I play basketball. Today, I'm playing tennis. Hey, where are my shorts? I haven't got any shorts. I don't need any football boots. I need some shorts. Rocky, where are my shorts? I've got your shorts. Look! But they're too big. You need a belt. When does Ricky play basketball? He plays basketball on Tuesdays. What does Ricky need to play football? He needs some shorts. Are the shorts too big? 
or too small? They are too big. What's your favourite day? I like Sunday. Sunday is my favourite day. I like Sunday. Sunday is my favourite day. I have breakfast in bed, some biscuits and milk. Then I get up and I have a shower at ten. I phone my friends and we meet at twelve. We go to the park and then we have lunch. In the evening I am at home. I read every night before I go to bed. Tomorrow is Monday and I start the week again. The story of William Tell. In a small town in Switzerland, there is a hat in the square. Everyone must salute this hat or go to prison. This is Gessler's hat. Gessler. Is the governor of the town? He is a cruel man. William Tell is not afraid of Gessler. He does not salute the hat. Hey, you! Salute my hat. No. Take this apple, put it on your boy's head, and shoot. William Tell takes two arrows. He shoots. Why two arrows? One for my boy, and one for you. Take him to prison. William Tell is going to prison. It is windy and rainy. He escapes. Now he is free, and he can fight Gessler. Who's Gessler? He's the governor of the town. How many arrows does William Tell take? He takes two arrows, one for his boy and one for Gessler. Does William Tell go to prison? No, he doesn't. He escapes. The story of William Tell. In a small town in Switzerland, there is a hat in the square. Everyone must salute this hat or go to prison. This is Gessler's hat. Gessler. 
is the governor of the town. He is a cruel man. William Tell is not afraid of Gessler. He does not salute the hat. Hey, you! Salute my hat! No! Take this apple, put it on your boy's head, and shoot! William Tell takes two arrows. He shoots. Why two arrows? One for my boy, and one for you. Take him to prison. William Tell is going to prison. It is windy and rainy. He escapes. Now he is free and he can fight Gessler. Who's Gessler? He's the governor of the town. How many arrows does William Tell take? He takes two arrows, one for his boy and one for Gessler. Does William Tell go to prison? No, he doesn't. He escapes. Rocky's lucky cousin. This is my cousin Ralph. He lives in Australia. He wears shorts and sandals in December. He goes surfing in January. He plays tennis when I'm sleeping. Lucky Ralph! Life is fun in Australia. Where does Ralph live? He lives in Australia. What does Ralph wear in December? He wears shorts and sandals. What does Rocky do when Ralph plays tennis? Rocky sleeps. Getting ready. Um, what's the weather like today? Brr, it's cold. I need my sweater. And it's windy. I need my anorak. Oh, it's really cloudy. Where's my umbrella? Come on, Rocky. We're waiting for you. I don't like rainy days. Is Rocky hot? No, he isn't. He's cold. Who is waiting for Rocky? Ricky and Rita. Does Rocky like rainy days? No, he doesn't. At the museum. That girl looks friendly. That boy looks fun. Hi, what's your name? Hi, I'm Freddy. I'm Irish. Hi, where are you from? I'm Hannah. 
and I'm from South Africa. Look, our timetable. Our first lesson is history. And look, on Friday we go to the museum. That's great. Friday morning. Amy, wait! Why are you running? Because we're late. Hannah and Freddie are waiting for us. This is the Roman Hall. We are standing in front of the Romans. Uh, Freddie, are you listening? Oh. What are we doing here? Oh, this is exciting. Let's go and see the forum. Hmm. How do you say where is the forum in Latin? I don't know. I don't speak Latin. Now repeat after me. Ubi est forum? Oh no. Latin every day. When do the children go to the museum? On Friday. Who is waiting for Matt and Amy? Hannah and Freddie. Can the children speak Latin? No, they can't. Difficult homework. Good morning. First, let's see your homework. The llama and the condor live in the Andes. Where does the jaguar live? In the Andes. Hannah, can llamas run? Um. Can condors fly? Um. Hmm. Hannah, you don't know the answers, do you? I can help, Hannah. Where are we? We're in South America, in the rainforest. Look at the beautiful butterflies. What's that? Oh, it's an iguana. It's cute. Cute. And look, there's a condor. And some mountain goats. Freddy, are goats big? Yes, they are. Have they got horns? Yes, they have. Can they run and jump? Yes, they can. Where are the children? They're in the rainforest. What's the name of this animal? It's an iguana. Can goats run? Yes, they can. At the court of Queen Gertrude. We usually have PE in the gym, but today we're going to the park. And we're playing football. I can't get the ball, Matt. I've got an idea. Hello, Mr. Frog. But where are we? Where are you going? To the Queen's castle.
We're not having sandwiches today. We're having roast beef. I usually teach these children, but now I'm queen of the castle. We always go to bed at half past nine, but tonight we're stargazing. Look, a shooting star! Quick, make a wish. Ah ha ha. Where are the children going today? They're going to the park. What are they having for dinner? They are having roast beef. What are they doing tonight? They are stargazing. The mystery of the missing queen. This month we're studying English history, and today we're going to the wax museum. Here are the kings and queens of England: Queen Elizabeth, King Edward, King Charles. He's got beautiful curly hair, but. That's Queen Victoria's throne, and she isn't there. What does she look like? Oh, she's short. She's fat. She's got grey hair. Excuse me, ma'am. Are you Queen Victoria? Don't be silly. Do I look like Queen Victoria? The Queen's shorter, she's fatter, and she's older. I'm looking for her in the wrong place. Let's go to the castle. There she is, in front of her castle. She's shorter than me. Uh oh, she looks grumpy. Ah, here you are. Come back to the museum with me, please, and back to the twenty-first century. What are the children studying? They're studying English history. What does King Charles look like? He's tall and has got long, dark, curly hair. Where's Queen Victoria? She's in front of the castle. Higher, faster. That film was super, the best. Well, tell me about the film. What's it about? A race from London to New York in a hot air balloon. In a hot air balloon, that's amazing. First we cross England, then we cross Ireland, then the Atlantic Ocean. Oh, we're flying over London. That's Big Ben. It's got the largest clock in Britain. Listen. There's the Atlantic Ocean. Is it the biggest ocean in the world, Matt? Uh, no. I think it's uh. No. The Pacific Ocean is the biggest ocean. Mount Everest is the highest mountain. 
The Nile is the longest river and... And you're the smartest girl. Oh, no! We're going down! Where are the life jackets? Hannah, is that the smallest island in the world? Ah, oh, a whale! The whale is the largest mammal in the world. Shut up, Hannah. We've got a problem. Freddy, what are we doing? We're racing to New York. To New York? Sure, Matt. Surfing on a whale is the coolest way to win this race. What's the film about? A race in a hot air balloon. Is Big Ben the largest clock in Britain? Yes, it is. Which is the largest mammal in the world? It's the whale. I want to be... Matt, what do you want to be when you grow up? An explorer. What about you? Mm, I don't know. I want to be a computer programmer. Nah, that's boring. I want to be a scientist. The Galapagos Islands. How exciting! Here we can see the oldest tortoises in the world and the biggest iguanas. What are you doing, Hannah? I'm drawing that dolphin. Dolphins are mammals, you know, and... What's that, Matt? What is it? It looks like a ship. Oh no! It looks like a pirate ship. It's coming this way. Is there a flag? Can you see their flag? No, I can't. It's too foggy. Matt, what are you doing? Hey, you can't run away if you want to be an explorer. Who wants to be an explorer? I don't want to be an explorer. I want to be a diver. What does Matt want to be when he grows up? An explorer. What is Hannah doing? She's drawing a dolphin. Can the children see a flag on the ship? No, they can't. Freddy and the Dragon Today we're studying history. Freddy, who is the patron saint of England? St George. What was he? He was a famous knight. <coughs> there was a terrible dragon. Everyone was afraid of him. George, go and kill the dragon. At once, Your Majesty. The dragon was by the river. 
It's Mum. Freddy, dinner is ready. OK, I'm coming. Is the dragon friendly? No, he isn't. He's terrible. Where is the dragon? He's by the river. Who is calling Freddy on the phone? His mum. Holiday fun. What are we going to do this summer? I'm going to learn how to fly. Oh, and I'm going to learn how to jump. Don't be silly. You can't fly and you can't jump. You're too young. I know. I'm only kidding. I'm going to go camping with my family. It's going to be fun. I'm going to learn French and Spanish in a summer school. I'm going to go surfing. Can we come too? First, we get a bus to the train station. Then, the train to the airport. After that, we get on a plane and fly to America. Then, we get off the plane and on to another bus. No, it's easy. Come with me. We're going to have a fantastic time. Goodbye. See you next year. Who's going to learn how to fly? Matt. Does Hannah go to a summer school? No, she doesn't. She goes camping with her family. Are the children on the beach? Yes, they are. To the beach. Shells, rocks and shells, rocks and shells. We are going to find rocks and shells, rocks and shells, to gather by the water, to gather by the water. We are going to build a sand castle, sand castle, sand castle. We are going to build a sand castle, sand castle, with bridges and a tower, with bridges and a tower, with bridges 